So I'm Jean-Sylvain Sermani and I'm president of Snowden Studios. Snowden Studios has been founded in 2010 and by industry veteran, in the last couple of years we've been doing a little bit of service, we've been working and collaborating on very exciting AAA titles and we're now really pleased to be working on our own IP and Windforge is the first original IP we're producing. So I'm Evan Hahn, I'm the uh, game designer of Windforge and also one of the co-founders of Snowden Studios. Windforge is a steampunk building block RPG. Um, basically it takes a game like Contra and mixes it with the freedom of Minecraft. In Windforge you will be able to build and fly fully functional airships. We have over 500 items in the game and the list keeps on growing. It has a large completely destructible procedural world with multiple environment types. And we have an epic storyline that drives gameplay without constricting freedom. In Windforge, you will be able to build anything you want, create anything you want, and destroy anything you want. Our goal is to empower you to create whatever you need, whatever you can see, without adding too much tedious grinding. So in addition to crafting, you will still be able to buy things in shops and find things around the world. My name is Tara Phillips. I'm one of the artists here at Snowden Studios. The look and feel of the game is really interesting in my opinion. It's kind of a steampunk sort of styled characters and ships and buildings taking sort of the fashion from the World War II era kind of military soldiers. A lot of these really fine details that really give it a unique character. But then outside of that sort of human element of the game, you have this really fantastical kind of environment of floating islands and flying creatures. We're really focusing on um, showcasing beautiful art, animated painstakingly by hand, um, and we really think that this is going to create a very different and interesting look for a game. Okay, I'm Ryan Harrison, I'm one of the artists at Snowden Studios. Characters have evolved a lot over time since we first started the project. The character style for Windforge is based off of war era clothing, as well as the Rocketeer, and steampunk, diesel punk fashion. We go to great lengths to make the characters very customizable, ranging from everything from your weapons, to your clothes, to boots on your feet. Windforge has a lot of unique enemies. Uh, some of the most famous ones we have so far are the Sky Whale, the Kraken, the Shog, and the Mantis. One of my personal favorites is the Sky Whale. I had a lot of fun designing the Sky, and we went through a huge iterative process just to get the right look. In Windforge, uh, everything people do is ultimately reliant on whale oil. The machines they use are powered by whale oil. The food is shipped using whale oil. People are so hungry for whale oil that pretty soon they're going to be extinct. In an attempt to save the way of life of everybody at Windforge, uh, you have been secretly hired to research an ancient technology. This technology is taboo and has the potential to save your way of life. So hopefully while you're looking at this video, the game has been now uh, approved on Greenlight. If we are not yet, uh, we would like you to uh, vote for our title on Greenlight. And uh, now that we have this momentum, we want to be able to focus purely on that project. So the, this last push is really for us to focus on this last phase and deliver the best experience we can. Our response for Windforge has been amazing so far. We've been having a great time showing it off at conferences like PAX and GDC. And the feedback we got from the conferences has been amazing. It's pushing us to make a way better game. We even got some crazy ideas that have made it into the final product. Seeing people play Windforge has been rewarding, but seeing them actually enjoy it has been even more rewarding. At Snowden Studio, we have worked for almost two years on Windforge, a PC game that blends the fun of Minecraft and Terraria with a RPG shooter. We are in the last phase of development and we need your help to make the dream of publishing our first large-scale game a reality. If you support us, we will be able to complete the game and promote it in 2014. Our studio has worked on some of the best video games in the world for clients. Now we need to leverage that expertise to launch an original titles of our home. From everyone at Snowden Studio, thanks.